everybody, we have just arrived in Wales, nowhere specific. Well, actually, no, there is, there is somewhere specific. We're at the Care Philly service station, and already it's in Welsh. How do you reckon you say this? Bwyd Poeth? Brech Danau? If any uh, Welsh viewers out there would like me to correct me on any of that, do feel free, but you're probably going to be there for a while because I have a feeling that was all wrong. By the way guys, this isn't sponsored, but whilst we are here on this road trip, we've been using an app called Splitwise and what it allows you to do is keep track of your expenses and um, so if one person pays for something that all three people should share, you can track how much each person owes each other and it's an absolutely incredible app, like everything that you want in terms of keeping tracking of spendings and budget and sharing of expenses it's absolutely fabulous and it's a free app so yeah i really recommend using splitwise if you're going on a trip and you're going to be sharing expenses with the other people that you're with so apparently this town is actually called kafili i wasn't too far off and we've just come to kafili castle which is the second biggest castle in the uk i believe if, if tal's facts are correct it's awesome it's like a proper medieval castle with a moat and everything. We're gonna go explore around the ground. Do they still make castles nowadays? No way. Oh, oh wow. Imagine if they did. Imagine way. being able to live somewhere like this or, or like if the government were just like, I'm just I'm gonna start saying. building a castle. Like how great, how great to be able to, uh, people actually live here. Imagine that, imagine living in like a proper castle, like a castle. What is in there, Jello? I don't know. You don't know? I don't, but I go to try to find out. Yeah, you're scared. Go have a look. Go on, Jello, I follow. Oh. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Scared me! Why are you making such noises? Oh, I think he's. Oh, I think he's congested. Congested? Oh no, he's definitely got diarrhea. Tal, do you know how old this is? Well, it's 12th century, right? 12th century. Yeah, they started building it and then it got collapsed and then rebuilt by the Welsh, I think, in the 13th century. Wow. Do you think that, that wall is gonna fall today? I saw something about there being like a leaning tower of that something. That started so. leaning in the 17th century, that's really? all I know. Yeah. Ah, so clearly they didn't build it too well because then it started leaning. You do look like a seal. the staircase to get right to the top where the flags are. Well, I'm working my cars, I am. I don't know about you. I see the light. Oh no, but that's not even the top. <laughs> oh, it's just a teaser right there, isn't it? Whee! Kafili! Kafili? Kafili? Hello, Wales. How are you doing? You're looking mighty fine and green. You may or may not know this fact about me, but I am half Welsh and yet <laughs> can not do a Welsh accent. In the valleys, and tonight we're going to say it another YHA, somewhere in Pembrokeshire. I don't know how long it takes us to get there, <laughs> but we're going to drive in the car. To be fair, I reckon you've probably heard worse. All right, we're going to Caerphilly. Go back down these stairs, back down to reality. Goodbye, Caerphilly Castle. We've just rocked up at our next YHA, which is in Pfuel Derry. I'm probably saying that so wrong. It's like 
dairy. I don't know. I don't know how to speak Welsh, guys. It is in the most remote location we've been so far, and I feel like that's saying something, but the view, oh uh, my goodness. My first concern is there's probably no service here. Ah, but I feel like with this view, should I care? No, not really. The only thing I won't be able to do is upload these vlogs daily, but meh, is it worth it? I think so. I really wanna go on a hike around here because this just looks absolutely breathtaking. But first, I'm really hoping they have coffee in this YHA because I am desperate for a coffee. This is our tiny little room, but <gasps> this is our view. Heaven, absolute heaven. So I've got to say, even though this hostel has no service and no Wi-Fi, it is absolutely stunning. And the facilities are amazing as well. The view in the dining room is out of this world. Like, I can't believe it's a hostel and it's so well kept as well. There's only seven rooms in this hostel, so you're always gonna have a really nice quaint vibe. And I've already said hello to pretty much all the guests who are staying here. I've been here about 10 minutes. And I really like that in the hostel. I love the cozy feeling and the family feeling. And it is nice once in a while to get disconnected and just appreciate the beauty that's around you. Good morning, everybody. We have woken up in... Good morning. Paul Derry. It was a beautiful night last night. I think I will have just shown you the time lapse that we got of the Astro. Tal's right now somewhere trying to fly his drone. I, I think he's been successful, but I'm not too sure. If he's got some good footage, I'll show that to you now. Oh, did you hear that click? You always gotta do a high kick in the morning to get like a stretch in. These are another one from Fabletics. I'm feeling like a, not like a dominatrix, that's definitely not the right word. I'm feeling like a, uh, a gazelle. Like, they're really. So yeah, this is what's happening. She's the daughter of the wind. Wind's daughter. I, I, I didn't hear what you said, but that's fine. Today we are heading off to Snowdonia, but first thing we need to do is get some breakfast yes, or brunch. Please. Like a big coffee. And a big, big yeah. coffee and somewhere with Wi-Fi because we need Wi-Fi because I'm going to upload this daily vlog. Well, not this one. I haven't edited this one yet, but one from the other day. You haven't ever tried daily vlogging? No. Have you? How am I going, guys? Are you enjoying these? Let me know. You have to start with Wi-Fi. Sorry, Wi-Fi is in Wales. Wi-Fi? Yeah, but they say Wi-Fi, <laughs> which is funny. Yeah. In Spain, we, we used to say Wi-Fi. Uh, you have to start with uh, batteries mm -hmm. and data mm -hmm. and, and editing. The whole thing is just a faff, but Jello has been keeping up with it so well. He was, he's been up at 2.30 every evening editing vlogs, and they're so good. Guys, make sure you go and check out Jello's channel. And in particular, the <laughs> vlogs that we're making because they're so mm. good. Good morning, Tal. Good morning. Could you get some good stuff? Oh. Oh. Oh, oh. oh baby. Oh, baby. I think it's time to get going, don't you? Yes. <laughs> Lego! Oh, look at these colourful houses. What was this town called again? Like Fia Fully Blim. No, it was called Aberlim Blim. Aberlim Blim. Aberlim Blim. Aberlim Blim. Aberlim Blim. Aberlim but they have beautiful, colourful houses. What is he doing? Tal has got, oh geez. Basically the situation is that Tal, I mean I think Jello's keen as well, but they're both like super keen just to find some sheep, as in like play with the sheep, run around with them. What? Who has aspirations to do such things? And so we pulled onto the side of the road somewhere in West Wales. No like finding the sheep? No, it's a barbed wire fence there. 
<laughs> but we're gonna do a chant to hype us up. Sheep, 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 sheep. I mean, they're just sheep. Am I being ridiculous here that I'm just not excited by sheep at all? There's loads of them everywhere and that this they're just a thing that you have to accept. Why feel the need to chase them, play with them? They're probably really scared. When the boys eventually come back from chasing sheep, we will be making our way to Aberystwyth, Aber Spaghetti Bolognese, Aber the Dig the one that I can never say. I think that's a big university town. I seem to remember when I was actually considering to go to university. That was the one that kept coming up and I can't remember whether it's because I was considering a course there or whether it was just the fact that it started with AB so it was always at the top of every list suggesting universities. Or maybe I've seen an advert for it. But I'm pretty sure it's a university town. We're hoping we can get some good Wi-Fi there. Okay, we've made it to the Costa in Aberystwyth. I got myself a mocha and a fajita wrap and a brownie, which is legit. If I come to Costa and they're serving the brownies, I always get it because it is hands down the best brownie in the world. Like, kid you not. But anyway, my video is uploading, so I'm really gonna be able to get the daily vlog up, which is amazing. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Make sure you go follow Tal and Jello eating their food over there. If you haven't already for another take on this uh, road trip and for some other awesome videos, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.